to better understand the science of the top-ranked competitive eater in the world, Joey Chestnut, we arranged an informal eating contest. 30 hot dogs, five minutes, as fast as we possibly can do it. Any real man could. Warning, Joey is a professional. Do not try this at home or anywhere, really. Ready? Three, two, one, go! In the time it takes me to eat one hot dog, Joey scarfs down ten. Here's how he does it. Oh. First, the jaw. It begins with the masseter muscle. Pound for pound, one of the body's strongest. Some competitive eaters train this muscle by chewing five or more sticks of gum at once. In fact, we've measured the bite of competitive eaters at 280 pounds of force, a bite stronger than a German Shepherd's. Next, the esophagus. The body relies on rhythmic contractions called peristalsis to move food down the esophagus. Competitive eaters can also use what's called a vasalva maneuver, kind of like pinching your nose shut and attempting to exhale with your mouth closed to clear your ears. This increases thoracic pressure and like squeezing a tube of toothpaste can help move the food through the esophagus. By bouncing up and down, Joey also uses gravity to accelerate the process. I'm doing whatever it takes to get it in. There's nothing pretty about it. And finally, the stomach. Joey pushes the limits of stomach expansion, training his stomach to increase by roughly 400% from its ordinary volume of about one liter to more than four liters. Body fat takes up valuable space for stomach expansion, which is why many competitive eaters are surprisingly fit. I ate three hot dogs in five minutes, which actually is a personal record. But compared to Joey, it's pathetic. In that same five minutes, Joey polished off 30 hot dogs, roughly 9,000 calories. That means in five minutes, Joey ate as much as the average person eats in about five days. For ESPN Sports Science, I'm John Brinkus.